<laughs> Wait, I just started. I just, I haven't even sung anything yet. He is definitely obsessed with singing. Um, ah! He's a big fan of you. Disney. I walked with you once upon a dream. <laughs> Also, Broadway. Casper, can you hear me? <coughs> Way above the chimney top. <coughs> Obsessed is the best word I can use to describe how he feels about his vocals and their contribution to this world. <laughs> Casper actually didn't have a voice as a puppy. We would hear him attempt to make sounds, but they came out like raspy and squeaky. I love you. <laughs> and it started kind of as a party trick. We would just howl, he would howl back. <laughs> then one day I was just playing guitar and singing songs and he decided to sing along. Bless your soul, I got your head in it was the loudest, craziest noise I had ever heard. I'm a big musical theater person. I grew up around the Broadway scene. I was actually trying to put together a self-tape for an audition, and so was Casper. If we've still got... He had to steal the spotlight. He always does. This is my audition. He definitely took front row of my life. Now, I can't watch any great movie musicals, like The Sound of Music, without him singing along. Our greatest showman. Every time a song comes on, he sings along. I thought we were gonna watch it. We did a talent show for work. Coming up, don't worry. <laughs> when the audience flipped out, that's when it hit me. I was like, there's something here. <laughs> and then America's Got Talent reached out to us. It was so exciting. And then we did it for the judges and he nailed it. Casper, let's sing Don't Speak, but you come in on the chorus, okay? Casper and I have a very special bond. I do sometimes refer to him as my son. There can be a really strong connection and understanding between people and animals if they explore it. And Casper and I have definitely explored that. You just gotta give him a chance. And I'm so glad I did. I'm about to sing the greatest song you've ever heard. This 